Hello and welcome to LearnPythonTutorial.com, the Python glossary, and today we're going to talk about get threshold. It is a function in the garbage collection module, and we're just going to discuss what it means and how it all works, okay? So um, first we need to import uh, the garbage collection module, so we do import GC, garbage collection, hit return. Now we imported that module. Now we want to get the threshold. What is the threshold? The threshold is when is the garbage collection going to run. So we want to get that threshold. We want to get those numbers. When will, when will it run? To do this, we do gc get underscore threshold parentheses. So we're getting the get threshold function. And it's going to return to us what our threshold is. Now we got 700, 10, and 10. So 700 is the first set or the first time garbage collection will run on a certain object. This is for the new objects, okay? Um, the second one is for objects that survived the first round. They go into the second round of garbage collection. And this will run after this first one has ran 10 times in this example. And the third one is if the object survived the second one. So they survived the first one, the second one, and the third one. They go to the third round and they will stay in there until they are removed. So the first one. Let's talk about how what 700 means. 700 is the allocations and the deallocations. When the deallocations it's the allocations minus the deallocations. When the deallocations reach 700, that number, count it, 700, then the first garbage collection will run. If an object in there is not deleted by the first run, it's moved into the second run. Now, what's the 10? How is that calculated? Is that with allocations and deallocations? No, it's not. It's how many times the first round of garbage collection is run. So if this is ran 10 times, then the second round of garbage collection is going to run. And then if an object's not removed by that, it's moved into the third round of garbage collection. And this number is based off how many times this runs for the second uh, garbage collection. So if this runs 10 times, which in theory would be 7,000 allocations, if you think about it, 700 times 10 is 7,000. So after 7, thousand allocations then this one will run and if you think about that for this to run we need 70,000 if my math is correct let's do uh, 700 times 10 times 10 70,000 so you need 70,000 uh, allocations minus deallocations for this to work. So basically that's how it would work. Um, so don't worry about this number, 7,700, 10, 10. Don't worry about that. I was just going along and I was like, I wonder how many times it would actually need to be ran for that to happen. So 70,000 times um, before the last bunch of objects are removed. All right, so we can change this number. Um, we're not going to do it in this tutorial here. This is just talking about how we get the threshold. But you can change this number using the uh, garbage collection module. Now, if you have any questions about this, please leave a comment in YouTube or on our website, learnpythontutorial.com. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.